Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Mindful Movement this morning. Uh, we're going to move a little bit and we're going to have a little bit of mindfulness and uh, some nice stretches. So no props today. And when you're ready, let's just start. Let's start a little bit of mindfulness here. So just standing in what we call mountain pose. We're going to just uh, rock forward and back so you can really feel your feet on the floor, feeling grounded, and eventually just come to standing. And feet are feeling grounded, but you want your body to feel tall. So you're lengthening from your, uh, your spine, your lower spine, all the way up through the back, all the way up through your neck. Top of the head is shining towards the ceiling. Roll your shoulders up and back, hands at the side with palms forward, and just relax the shoulders down your back. If you want to go ahead and close your eyes or just gaze down your nose, uh, you can do that. And we're going to bring our attention and our awareness to our breath just for a moment, just to center and ground ourselves. Find a place where we can kind of escape from anything that was occupying your mind before you got here, letting go of your to-do list, letting go of, of anything that may have been causing you any tension this morning, taking the next 15 minutes to just stretch it out and, and let it all go, let it all go from your mind. So concentrating on your breath. And maybe with each breath, just lengthening it a bit as you inhale and lengthening it as you exhale. Coming to a place of calmness. Nice big inhale. And exhale. Just letting it all go. Making sure you're relaxing your fingers, you're not tensing anything up. Letting go of tension between your eyes on your forehead. Again, relaxing your shoulders slight bend in your knees, turning the corners of your mouth up for a nice smile, and let's all inhale together. You can open your eyes and bring the arms up overhead. Exhale, lower. Inhale, raise up, and exhale, lower. This time, as you inhale, bring the arms up, leave them up. Take the right hand into the left. Inhale as you reach up. And as you exhale, just bend over to the left. Opening up the right side body. Feeling a nice stretch of the obliques. You'll notice your rib cage opening up. There's space there, so perhaps sending the breath into that space. And as you exhale, come on back up. Let's take the left hand into the right this time. Inhale, reach up. And as you exhale, coming over to the right. This time the left side body is extended. Feeling the stretch in the obliques. Feeling the opening in the rib cage. Let's send a nice big breath into that space. And as you exhale, come on up. Lower the arms with an exhale. Inhale, raise the arms. And as you exhale, forward fold at the hips. Come on all the way down and just let everything go. So your belly is resting on the top of your thighs. So bend the knees. You have a nice little place for your belly to rest. Head is just let it go. Just let it fall. You might want to shake it one way or another just to make sure it's all hanging there. Let those shoulders relax as your arms hang down. Beautiful. And then as you inhale, walk the hands up and we're going to land with the hands on the thighs. So if you want a little bit better balance, a little more stability, you can take a wider stance. Just heel toe your feet out wide, putting your hand, leaving your hands on your thighs. We're going to do a couple cat cows here. So as you inhale, lift up your hips, lower your belly, and bring your head up. 
And as you exhale, tuck the hips in, bring the belly button up and bring your chin down to your chest. Cat. Inhaling, drop the belly, lift the tailbone, lift the head for cow. Exhaling into cat, rounding the back. And go ahead and do a few more of these. Mindful movements, so breath is flowing with your movement. But go ahead and stay in any position that might feel good this morning. Sometimes with all the sitting that we do, the cat feels really good on the lower back. And just finish up wherever you are and come to a nice flat back. And lower down as you exhale, all the way down again, forward folding into that nice relaxed position. Bend the knees and let's come up one vertebrae at a time, very slowly and gently, all the way up, roll the shoulders back and bring the feet in. And let's just bring a little bit of movement here. So we're just gonna start by lifting the knees up. Just like you're walking, maybe you might wanna even rotate the hands around as you're doing this. You don't have to lift the knees high. We're not trying to break a sweat or anything. We're just trying to get a little bit of movement happening. And maybe you just start to kick behind you and bring the hands behind, just tapping your heels. And from here, let's just kind of come up onto the toes. Same movement, but coming up to the toes and we're gonna reach up and keep that movement going with the feet just as you're reaching up and really reach. Don't be straining your neck so you don't want to be reaching right over your head. Maybe a little bit forward. Let's take that reach to the front. Nice and slow. And then let's reach it down. Just touching the opposite knee. Just to get a little movement going here. Like I said, not breaking a sweat. Reach out front again. And one last time reaching above. All right, and then just come to stand stillness. Give your legs a shake. And let's come into a little bit of stretching here. So we're gonna take the right foot forward and the left foot's gonna come back. So a nice big long step back with the left foot and we're going to come into a lunge so your right knee is bent and try to press your heel down on the floor in your right foot so you want to feel that stretch in through your calf here and let's take the right arm across nice little stretch in there through the shoulder and then releasing that take a little bit of a step in or come up, sorry, come up high on your toe there. Press your, press your thigh in, your hip in, and then come down slowly. Now you're feeling a nice stretch in through here. This is your hip flexor. This is the, the muscle that shortens while you're sitting. Let's take the arm back between the shoulder. And you can go ahead and push up a little bit if you want. Keep pressing that hip forward. And then release and now step forward just a little bit with that back foot. Put the weight on your back foot and bring the front toe up. Just holding it here. You can reach out if you like with your left hand. And then release and let's do the other side. So we're gonna take the right foot forward and the left foot's gonna come back. So a nice big step back. So you're coming into a lunge position. Front knee is bent over top of your ankle. And let's go ahead and press that heel down so you feel the stretch in through the calf at the back. And we're gonna take the left arm across. Just keep breathing. Giving all that energy into the muscles. And then you can release that. Come up onto your toe and bring your hip forward. So you're flexing the hip forward, feeling the stretch now all through the 
hip flexor on the left leg, and then maybe come down. So by bending your front knee a little bit, you're going to feel a bit more intensive uh, intensity in the stretch. And then bring that left arm down between your shoulder blades and just pressing up slightly. Keep pushing the hip forward. Nice deep breath in and out. And then release that. Step the foot slightly forward. Put the weight on the back foot, bringing that front toe up. And once again, you can bring your hand forward. Nice little balance. Holding it here. Nice big deep breaths in and out. And then let go. Shake out the feet. And let's take the right leg now. We're going to cross it over top of the left, so we're going to do some balance here, and then flex the foot so your toes coming towards your knee there. We're going to do a standing figure four, so once you're here, maybe you bend the left knee a little bit. Let's see how you do here. Whoops! <laughs> see, I was going to say we could do the, uh, the hands, and I lost my balance, but go ahead and just pressing your palm up and down, a little tricky there, and then let go, come on up, take that right leg, and we're going to do a quad stretch, so taking it behind you, bring the leg in close, so your thighs are close together, and it's not way out here, and then go ahead and press your hip forward, take a little pressure off your knees, and get that stretch right where we want it in the quads. Nice job. Gently release the leg. Let's do the other side. So now we're standing on the right leg. Let's take the left leg, crossing it up. Flex that toe in towards your knees. Ooh, don't look at me because I'm kind of wobbling this morning. And come on down. It's always a challenge. Balance with me. And then go ahead and you can take that left hand up. Pressing back, stretching out the forearm and down. Good job. All right, release the hands and release that leg. And let's take the left foot now into a quad stretch. So taking it behind you, bringing your thighs together, press the hip forward. Holding it here for a moment, feeling the stretch in through the quad. And then release, shake it out. Let's just bring the head forward. And back. And forward. And back. And then come to neutral. Look over your right shoulder. And bring the head across. Chin comes across the chest. And looking over the left shoulder. And one more time. Bringing it across the chest. Looking over the right shoulder. And then bringing your chin across one last time, looking over the left shoulder. And then bring your chin back to your chest, lift your head up to neutral, taking the right ear to the right shoulder and extending the left arm out. Always breathing. Take every opportunity to breathe in some fresh air and Exhale any of the bad stuff inside. Go ahead and bring your head up. Arm comes down. Left ear to left shoulder. And take the right arm up. And it's time to take a few breaths. You've got nothing else to really worry about or think about right now. Take the arm down. And bring the head back to center. And let's take the right leg and cross it over the left. The right arm's going to come up with the left down. And we're going to stretch that right out. So stretching the fingers up, stretching the fingers down. Go ahead and wiggle them. Maybe rotating the wrists, rotating them the other way. 
And then as you exhale, walk yourself down, 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 bending at the hips. And put your hands on the floor or on your shins, wherever you need to, and just let that go. Feel a nice stretch all up your lower back, your spine, the back of your legs. Nice, walk it up. And let's do the other side. So left leg crosses over right, left arm comes up, right arm comes down and really stretching in both directions. Nice full stretch, wiggle the fingers, rotate the wrists. Give them lots of movement there. And as you exhale, walk yourself down. Let it all go. And then walk yourself back up. Coming to standing. Let's take a nice deep breath in together. And exhaling. One more time. And this time exhaling, coming all the way down to the floor. Back up. And that's it for stretch today. I hope you're feeling stretched. I hope you're feeling a little less uh, stressed out and you're feeling good. And, and you're going to enjoy some of the beautiful sunshiny day today. Thanks for joining me. Have a wonderful day.